Good morning, Mount Olive. I'm Pastor Bender, and I'm blessed again. Yes, you've made the right connection with the Mount Olive family. We are blessed here today. I want to call your attention today to Hebrews 10, 25. And we're going to ask that Sister, Sister Zora Bender would read from the Word of God. Sister Bender. Hebrews 10, 25. Not forsaking the assembling of ourselves together, as the manner of some is, but exhorting one another, and so much the more, as ye see the day approaching. For well, a few precious moments today, I want to talk to you from the subject. What did you come to this service for? What did you come to this service for? For there's a song that says, What did you come to this service for? That says, Did you come to point a finger? Yes, if you didn't come to praise his name, then you should walk right out the door. I've said to you today, yeah, stay in here, the word of God. Ain't God good today? Point one is saying to us today, did you come to show off? Did you come to show out? Did you come screaming? Did you come using for profanity? Did you come fighting? Did you come dressed provocatively? Or did you come, yes, to see what others are wearing? Did you come with no respect for the church of God? Eating, drinking, and not listening to the word of God. I want you to listen to the word of God. The word of God says to us. Don't come to show off or show out. Point two. Did you come to render service? Did you come to praise his name? Did you come to teach? Did you come to sing? Did you come to pray? Did you come to read the scripture? Did you come as an usher here today? Yes. Did you come to pay your tithes, your talents, and your treasures? Final point. Did you come to exhort one another? Exhort means to encourage, urge, lift up. Yes, we do this by a friendly hello, a smile, be be positive, a handshake, yes, say amen to the word. Can you do that today? Matthew 22 and 21, it says, Render therefore unto Caesar the things which are Caesar's, and unto God things that are God's. So I ask you again, what did you come to this service for? Be strong in your service to God because Scripture tells us before the end of time, fathers will be be against children. Mothers will be against daughters. 
wars and rumors of wars will come. So please, know why you are here today. Praise the Lord. To praise the Lord. That's really what God is saying to us today. Did you come to show off, show out? Yes. Did you come? What did you really come to do today? Did you come to render service? Did you come to exhort one another? Did you come as a friendly hello, a smile? Yes. What really did you come today? But I want to tell you what God has already said. What did you come to this service for? Uh -huh. What really did you come uh -huh, to say today? Mm -hmm. Not forsaking the assembling of yourselves together as uh, the manner of someone who wants to turn uh, and give God some praise. I tell you what you do then, go ahead and exhort one another. Let the world know whose side you on. But there's one more thing I want to tell you in, in closing today. And that is, uh, put your trust in God Almighty. Yes, sir. If you came to the service to praise God's name, uh, go on uh, in Jesus' name. Yes, sir. Tell the world what you really came to do. Uh, let them know that you can praise God uh, if you praise Him by yourself. Ain't God all right? Praise Him uh, and tell the world uh, you're standing in uh, the safety zone. Yes, sir. Whatever you came to do, praise his name, in Jesus' name, let the world know you're on his side. Yes, sir. I love the Lord. He heard my cry. He pitied my every groan, and I can tell the world I'm satisfied with Jesus. Yes, sir. I'm satisfied with Jesus. If you can't make me doubt him, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Praise his name. Thank you, Jesus. Yeah, yeah. Praise the Lord and give him joy today. Thank you. The door is open. I'm satisfied with Jesus. Yes, I'm satisfied with Jesus. Yes, I'm satisfied with Jesus. In my heart. Yes, I'm satisfied with Jesus. You know I'm satisfied. Fire with Jesus, you know I'm a satisfied with Jesus in my heart. You can't make me doubt him, 
No, no, you can't make me doubt him. No, no, you can't make me doubt him. In my heart, oh, yeah, yeah, you can't make me doubt him. Yes, I know too much about him. You know I'm satisfied with Jesus in my heart. Yes, you can't make me doubt him. No, no, you can't make me doubt him. No, no, you can't make me doubt him in my heart. Yeah, yeah, you can't make me doubt him. No, no, you can't make me doubt him. Yes, you can't make me doubt him in my heart. The door is open. If there's anyone here out of the ark of safety, the Lord said come, Jesus said come, the Holy Spirit said come. Whosoever will, let him come. While the blood is still running warm in your veins, while you still have the right exercise of your mind, your movement of your fingers of a phalanges, if I were you, I'd come on to Jesus. Come on to Jesus right now. God bless you today. <laughs>